Hey guys, what's good and what's popping? It's your girl Dimes here and welcome back to Vlogmas! So today, I, I've been thinking about this for a while. I told you guys that I haven't been filming fashion videos because I kind of want more space, but I'm like, you know what? Sometimes you just gotta do it and go for it. And today, I wanted to kind of bring you some holiday, holla slay outfit inspo. So it's gonna be like a little chit chat. I'm gonna be popping in some styles throughout. So let's get holiday inspired. The holiday season is definitely something where I feel like you can be as bold as you want to now of course you can be bold every day clearly but the holiday season gives me sparkles i think feathers i think leather i think spice and i really want to show that today through like different ideas through textures i think that my favorite texture has to be the feathers like come on exhibit a and i feel like they are so fun like you can really dress up feathers you can dress down feathers but i think the feathers themselves are what is adding that extra pop to the look so i've seen feather galore like you can wear it like i am here with the pj set i think the silk and feather combo is chef's kiss i've seen like full-on feather dresses i've seen dresses with the feather trim which i actually have but um i've seen dresses with the feather trim on the top gloves to match like it is so cute and i feel like the feather trend is so perfect for this holiday season and you can really own it so my next texture is going to be sparkles 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 give me all of the sparkles i feel like this season feels like sparkles i love a good sparkly pant because you can really like play with that so much because your top honestly can kind of be very simple unless you want to do sparkle on sparkle like a sparkle pan and sparkle blazer that's an option that's cool but you can do like a really cute sweater um you can also do a simple tank a simple turtleneck on top and then you can just have fun on the bottom with your sparkly pants of course you have your sparkly skirt Skirts. I actually want to give you an example of how you can kind of like tone down sparkles. For example, I have this sparkly dress here, which is look how beautiful it is. Like, look at this. You're instantly going to become a disco baby in this. But let's say that you don't really want to wear too many sparkles. Like, you like the sparkles, but you want to tone down the sparkles. So, I was personally thinking I have this sweater, and I was thinking you can even put this dress on top of this turtleneck sweater and like if you want this to kind of be your base and then you have the skirt on top for a little extra added spice or if you want to kind of tone down the sparkles you can put this uh sweater on top of the skirt and it kind of like tones it down and i would definitely maybe pair it with like some dark stockings black stockings some flesh tone stockings with some boots a black beret like girl so my next texture is going to be velvet 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 is such a sexy texture like oh my gosh like no matter who has on velvet it just works it instantly makes you look richer and i feel like it is such a fun texture to wear especially for the holidays you can wear velvet with many things but i think my favorite is velvet in suits um like a velvet blazer and also a velvet pant Ugh. also of course you have your infamous velvet dresses and i think velvet dresses are so cute as well because it adds that nice kind of texture to the outfit that you're wearing and honestly like as a sidebar my boyfriend wears like these really cute velvet top and they just look phenomenal on him i think he has one in black and i think there's one in like this gray color oh my gosh literally instantly elevates i just had to throw that in there i think a velvet corset top mm. i just think they're so beautiful and you can really play on that as well if you do a suit you can do something like i have this sparkly top back there and i'm planning on wearing this velvet red suit with the sparklies underneath i think that's a fun texture play back to our sparkles and then also i love a good button down you can play with that velvet and silk as well i think that would be a fun texture to play with and back to like the velvet corset let's just say you have like a dark 
colored corset, right? I could see that with like some dark denim flare pants or even like a nice uh, tailored trouser. That would be really cute. Like an elevated business look or an elevated party look. Like you can definitely take it there with some velvet. My last kind of texture, and also I'm gonna have an honorable mention as well, but my last texture is going to be lace lace darling i just think lace is such a spicy texture you can do a lot with lace i personally love like a good lace bralette moment you can pair that with my next honorable mention leather lace and leather flocks together like that's what i'm gonna go with because you can do a really cute like lace bralette you can also pair it with like leather pants leather shorts but you know tis the season we're probably not wearing shorts unless you're in florida like me but pants shorts skirts midi dresses mini dresses oversized leather blazer or a fitted blazer with like a tall leather boot even yes and also just to kind of hit on touches of jewelry pieces i definitely feel like dependent on your outfit will depend on the type of jewelry that you should pair with it i saw these really cute burberry earrings i don't know if you guys have seen them but they have like this really big bow and then like i think a center of gold in there is a statement if your dress is a statement or if you feel like you don't want to do too much you can play around with how bold or how simple you want your jewelry to be. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. I hope you gained something here or learned something new or just enjoyed the vibes. If you did enjoy the vibes, you gotta subscribe, you know what I'm saying? So thank you guys so much for tuning in and I will catch you in the next one.